Okay, how you doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. Um, I was working on, actually I'm done. So this is the um, ca mini computer. Actually, I think it's a uh, Think Central <coughs> microcomputer <coughs> I got. And I decided to turn it into a little mini arcade PC. The only problem, it kept overheating like crazy. So I did a few modifications to it. Adding on to it a nice hard drive fan. Another large fan over top of the already CPU fan. For some reason that was not generating enough uh, cool air. And then at the bottom, if I can get around to the side here and show you, that the entire system is actually built on a rack system. Completely made out of all fans. So all the air is being drawn downward and pushed out through the bottom. So this is my own torture rack just using nothing but 140 millimeter fans to keep the system nice and cool and I don't have any problems with the overheat issues anymore so I'm just showing you what I did to a ThinkPad uh, ThinkPad, a th sorry not Think, a Thinking Central computer um, so uh, basically um, this is running uh, through my Chrissy projector and there it is displayed on the screen on our gamer paint so, I'm going to do a little gaming off of it, so you can see how amazing this is going to look. Also to on the gamer paint, but also to my little computer setup I'm working on. It's a little mini arcade. wasn't really doing anything with the uh, unit, and decided, let me see if I got the buttons on the bottom. Because one time I had the buttons at the bottom, and I turned off my phone. I'm putting it into the, uh, the bracket system to hold my phone up. There we go. All right, so I'm going to go into my account, and then from there I go into big stream mode, and I'm good to go. I mean, use up my controllers. So let me go into, uh, let me see. <sighs> Get my mouse and keyboard. Once I have this situated to a desk, it'll be so much easier to use. Right now I just have this scattered about on the floor. All right, open this up. And I should be able to get access to my... Steam account. There we go. And I am definitely going to go through. Um, well, actually, we need to build that up first. I might keep going back to that. Okay, no, whatever. You got to go into the big picture mode anyway. Big screen mode. I got to try to hit that again. We're good. Now we're in big screen mode. We're good. We're nothing but joystick ready. So I can just use my joystick and just go in and select what I want to play. I got this running through my speakers in the back. Let's see. I think we want to do more metal slug. And we're using this on our gamer paint that just launched today. This is my 50 inch screen. Uh, that I painted, I have another 135 upstairs. Metal slug. 
enjoy the, uh, the demonstration like I said I'm gonna keep it short and sweet um, so like I said uh, the gamer paint is launched now on our website uh, with free worldwide shipping it does come with free lead lights you can choose if you want free lead lights or not but we do add them in there um, and as I said before this is my little uh, computer that I actually uh, turned into actually my ThinkPad or not ThinkPad uh, Thinking Central is a Thinking Central uh, PC I got for around $130 I got my fans for around 16 bucks, and this little piece right here cost me uh, $2.50 for the hard drive cooler, keyboard and mouse I already had on hand already. And at the bottom, there is air pushing through the motherboard. I actually had to remove the motherboard, and I had to slice um, uh, grooves into the bottom of the casing underneath of this. So when the air shoots up, sorry, when air pulls down, it's pulling um, um, heat off the motherboard and pushing it out to the bottom. So that was a pretty tricky thing, trying to get the motherboard to disconnect all together. I had to take all that out uh, so the case would be empty. And then basically cut um, air holes into that. So the fans are actually pushing downward and pushing all the heat out to the bottom. These are the brackets I have, pieces I have at the bottom. To make sure that it has some airflow at the bottom to push out. And then the air from the top it's pushing air straight downward, so it's actually causing another vacuum system. And then I got a nice little fan here on the side. Right here. Keeping the hard drive nice and cool. Nice little system here. All right. Hope you enjoyed the short demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for your time. I have to go in. God bless.